and spared you. Let's put it this way. If Liquid uses Big Boss's genetic code, the original, he'll have the system completely under his control. Hold on. I thought having his code wasn't enough. You need his biometric data at the same time, don't you? That's right. And Big Boss is already dead. No. He's alive. Big Boss is alive. His body is. Or rather, his cells. That's impossible. Big Boss survives as a biomort. A brain-dead shell sustained in the lab. Liquid has already left for Europe in search of Big Boss's body. Right from the start, he knew his experiment in South America wasn't going to work. If Liquid obtains the body, he'll be primed to make his final move. Hmm. Allowing him total control of the system. Exactly. Unless we can stop him first. Heating up the R&D race. No. It's not just the PMCs, either. Every corporation tethered to the military-industrial complex is losing its sense of morality. And it's us science-holics who are doing their dirty work for them. Not even realizing it. Can we make Jack better? I don't know. Sunny. May I? Nothing we can do here. Hmm? What do you mean? Look at this. His artificial blood needs dialysis. We don't have the proper equipment. Dialysis? Getting his wounds healed is important too. But at this rate, he's not going to last that long. Dialysis. Is that like what k kidneys do? That's right. Raiden's blood is an older type of artificial blood that was used by the military. Called white blood. After it's been in use for a while, the blood needs to be dialyzed. Filtered. Right now, 
He's slipping into autotoxemia. Madnar. I've heard of him. A world-renowned cybernetics expert. Strictly underground, though. We're in luck, then. It's settled. We must head for Europe. The sooner we get there, the better. Uh, I'll call Campbell and have him get us landing clearance. Snake, where are you going? Well, I'm gonna be spewing up poison soon enough anyway. What's one more smoke gonna hurt? Uh-uh. This is a no-smoking flight. Who is this? Oh, her? That's my sister. Really? I never knew you had a sister. For a moment, I thought she might have been your girlfriend. No, I... I don't have a... I... Emma was a brilliant programmer. She wrote the worm that destroyed the Arsenal Gear AI. Then... Vamp killed her. I'm so sorry. No, there's nothing for you to be sorry for. Or me. <laughs> I used to be an anime otaku. Oh. So, that's where Otacon comes from. I was always fascinated by sci-fi anime. That's what got me into this line of work. It's too bad reality wasn't so simple. I never even imagined that science, that my own research, could cause so much misery. Oh. I mean, it's not like a science holics or Satanists or anything. But even when we've got the best of intentions, we end up being used by others for evil. 
Dr. Emrek, I... Uh, you see this? Sunny helped me build it. <laughs> really? Sunny helped build this? We built it using top secret docs and patents dug up from intranets at a bunch of research labs. To tell you the truth, I think she's better at it than I am. <laughs> but she's just a child. She cracked the protection on your mail. Well, I, um, assumed it was you. 